Hello everyone. Welcome to RPA feed. In this video, we will be talking about some of the most important Python libraries for RPA developer. Python is one of the most popular programming language, as you already know, that is used in RPA and these libraries can help you uh, make your automation project easier and more efficient. So first of all, let's understand what is a library. A library in Python is a collection of functions and method that allows you to perform a lot of actions without writing your own code. So basically a use like a reusable code. Uh, a library is a collection of uh, the functions and method which is already predefined and built so that you can directly use it without wasting uh, efforts to again code that piece and test it out. There are several Python libraries as I as we already discussed. Uh, some of the most popular ones that includes are PyAutoGUI. So PyAutoGUI is a cross-platform GUI automation library. It allows you to automate GUI interactions such as clicking buttons, typing text, and moving the mouse. This library is particularly useful for automating repetitive tasks that involve uh, interaction with your uh, GUI, graphical user interface, right? So this is the page uh, from where you can download the package and you can also refer to the example code snippet. Next is OpenPy Excel. OpenPy Excel is used to read and write Excel files, allowing you to work with spreadsheets in your RPA. When it comes to RPA and automation uh, without Excel, we cannot Im Im even imagine, right? Excel is mostly used in every RPA project, whether it's config file, whether it's manipulating data from one sheet to another sheet. So this library is very handy in such scenarios. Next is PyWin Auto. This library is used to automate Windows applications, allowing you to control and interact with GUI elements in Windows applications. So you can use this whenever you are automating Windows applications, desktop applications related to Windows. Next is Selenium. Selenium is a very popular web automation library that can be used for automating web browsers. It allows you to write scripts that can interact with web pages, fill out forms, and perform other tasks that involve web browsers. Selenium is a must-have tool for RPA developers who want to automate tasks that involve web browsers. Next in the list is PyTesseract. It is used for optical character recognition, OCR, allowing you to extract text from images and PDF files. This is helpful when you want to extract information from invoices, purchase order book, etc. So as you can see, uh, like whenever there is a text in a Word document or a PDF document and that you want to extract, then you can go for this libraries. In, in Automation Anywhere, the IQ board does the same. Next is PyPDF2. This library works with PDF file and can be used to automate tasks such as merging and splitting PDF files. And it, uh, it is also helpful uh, to extract text and images if you want to extract from PDF file. And then also you can, uh, this is handy. Last uh, in the list, uh, which we'll be talking is OpenCV. OpenCV is an open source computer vision library that can be used for image and video processing in RPA. It can be used for things like image recognition, object detection, and image comparison. It is a powerful tool for automating tasks that involve image and video data. So these are some of the most important Python libraries for RPA developers. Whether you are automating image and video processing tasks, GUI interactions, web browser or data analysis, these libraries can help make your automation projects easier and more efficient. I hope this video has been helpful. And if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.